It's Saturday. I see we're at Epcot Flower and Garden Festival. Um, it looks a little cloudy, so I'm hoping that it doesn't rain on us, y'all. Um, we just got here. I'm just ready to eat because I haven't eaten anything today, so I'm ready to eat. I don't know if we're gonna get on any rides. There are only like things like two rides here for us to ride anyway. So we're just gonna check out the different gardens or whatever you want to call it and um, check out the food which I am most excited about so let's just hope the rain holds up and we can enjoy ourselves all right y'all I'll see y'all in a minute I hope y'all can hear me through this mess are you focused camera look how pretty y'all this is beautiful to me I can just sit out here and just look at this all day so beautiful. Oh wow. Oh that's for kids, huh? You don't eat that, right? Look at those giant butterflies, y'all. There's a butterfly exhibit. I know the last time we came there was a butterfly exhibit. I wanna go in there. But look how big those butterflies are. Let me zoom y'all in. And that's all grass. The Lion King. Musafa and Simba. And what's the um do you know the name of the uh, the monkey? Do you know the name of the monkey? No, who? Musa no Musafa is the daddy. Simba is the baby. I don't know who this is. Jafar? Maybe. I don't know. We don't know y'all. Um, honey sweet corn spoon bread. Served with jalapeno record house with honey butter. Lavender honey mustard marinade. Chicken. Black bread. Do you see anything on there that you want to try? No? I don't know if it picks up. Okay, so this is first up. Flavorful kitchen. And I don't see anything that I want. Hmm? No? Do you remember the items that you were talking about? I think they had another pork belly that was looking better than this one. All right, y'all, so we haven't found anything that we want to try yet. The Duck family, Donald and Daffy, and their kids in the back. And do y'all hear the ducks? Listen. I think those are ducks quacking in the background. Let's see what they're talking about. That's boudin two ways and that's a uh, crawfish etouffee, y'all. This is like a New Orleans staple and I've never tried crawfish etouffee. That's crazy. Never tried it. Like when you said you want to try crawfish etouffee, I'll get my mind, I was like, I really it. <laughs> but it's fun. Come on, camera, pick my pizza. <laughs> We can have that problem. We're being kind of cold. I guess I'll try the S2P first. You ain't want that rice dirt in there. Like, what kind of rice is it? Dirty rice? Oh, okay. It tastes just how I imagine it tastes. Like crushes and all It's not bad. It has like a good flavor. Like you say, it should have been hotter. I 
Thank you. Now, sit back and other elements essential to our lives. Of all the forces at work on the land, humans have had one of the most profound effects, the need to produce food for... Yes, and I'm running in the sand, I think Welcome to our living laboratory, where scientists from Epcot and the U.S. Department of Agriculture are exploring innovative so ways to produce bountiful harvests now and into the future. Them. I don't know what else, spices or something? Edible flower. The tropics are home to the greatest diversity of plants on the planet. Jackfruit. Many of these, like papaya, bananas, cacao, coffee and rice, are well known around the world. These are just a few of the edible plants that have been an important source of nutrition for people living in the tropics. Many are rich in vitamins and minerals, while others are well adapted to growing in less than ideal conditions. Some, like the water lily, thrive in wet, swampy areas and waterways. All parts of this plant, even the flower petals, are edible. The starchy root of the plant has long been used to make flour for baking. When we mention farming, you probably don't think of fish. But fish farming, or aquaculture, accounts for nearly half of all the seafood consumed in the world. Tilapia, bass, and catfish, like the ones you see here, are three of the more popular crops raised by fish farmers. The sustainable system you're using here recycles the water in the tanks. As a result, we're able to save millions of gallons each year. Our small fish farm produces nearly 5,000 pounds of fish our everyday diet. The common grains growing here, wheat, maize, sorghum, is our integrated pest management program. By populating our greenhouses with beneficial insects that prey on harmful pests, like aphids and flies, we are significantly reducing our reliance on conventional pesticides. We're growing these crops using our nutrient film system. This technique precisely controls and... Not many Mickey, I mean. focus on my face give us some light all right y'all so soaring that was my first time getting on that ride it was cool the um what was it live with the land with the list something about living with the land living with the land come on camera that was cool now we're about to go into the butterfly what is it called the butterfly house come on and pick up on me with lighting please Give me some light camera. Some light. Y'all, I love butterflies. Sometimes they scare me, but I love butterflies. Like I've always wanted to get a butter get a caterpillar and watch it turn into a butterfly. Come on. There we go. So I've always wanted to get a caterpillar. Thank you. Do they have any now? There we go. Oh, there it is. Usually they have more than that flying around. I think they may have minimized it because I was going to pull this up and move my own. Like, okay, there's one butterfly. Where are the butterflies? Y'all, they don't have any butterflies in here this time. Yeah, 
don't know. Yeah, they're not flying. Some over there on the net, y'all. Okay. Not exactly what I thought. They're not flying around. They don't want to interact with us. There's one tiny one all the way over there. Why aren't they flying? We can't really see it. They don't want to fly around today. So, okay. What are those? Are those like the caterpillars turning into butterflies? Or oh, what is that? I think. Yeah, the cocoons. Okay. Oh, so disappointing. Yeah, but they're not flying around. So underwhelming, y'all. So underwhelming. So Tyron didn't get the memo that it was kind of cool out here, so he has to go get a sweatshirt. Uh, well, uh, yeah, sweatshirt. What is this called? A sweat jacket. Yeah, hoodie. He has to get a hoodie, y'all. And I'm taking it over afterwards because it's very cute. I'm ready to eat, y'all. We only ate one thing and it was barely anything. No, I think that's coffee, right? That's not like burnt. Y'all, so we, we could not find the boots that we're looking for. So for now, just to get something, we had to settle for the fish and chips. Did they say what kind of fish that is? Cause I don't know what kind of fish that is. <laughs> you don't care, huh? <laughs> Sorry, so you don't care, you ready to eat. Try this. This lighting is off. I don't know why my camera and it's making me look like I have bags. Can't go wrong with French fries. Wish I got a night. To be honest with you, okay. I like these um the size French fries, huh? Like this size. Oh, the biggest size. Mm -hmm. I still want 
tacos are, yeah, this is good. Yeah, this kind of hitting that hungry spot. Mm -hmm. We'll see y'all at the next spot. Give me some light camera. We'll see y'all at the next spot. We finally found one of the places that we've been looking for. That's uh, some kind of hash, corned beef and hash browns or something. I don't know. Now those look good. I don't know about this, y'all. Let me taste it. <laughs> So I know you're not gonna like him. because it said it had a brown gravy. We should have tried it, huh? I'm have to fuck this up. Yeah, we're not sitting in a good spot, so. Let me see. Mm. Of course, that's good. I'm I'm too eager to not to be up. I'm surprised you didn't taste it with the eggs. Oh, you don't? I thought you did. Oh, you like a burger. Mm -hmm. This right here. Mm. Mm. Sorry. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all. Hi, welcome. Hi. This is cool. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so this is new. The sign say that this is new, like a new area. Finally. Oh, let's get that. Let me see. Oh, look at those sliders. What do you see fried green tomatoes? Oh, okay. We don't have to get that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Definitely want those sliders though. I don't know if y'all can see. You wanna walk in and see what else? Yeah. Like, that? What we said about the soup? We looked at it. What is that? That, that, that comes to eat. That was that. We oh, that was that? It. Okay. See this? I like something different on this side. What is this again?